pioneers of television. Perhaps the most unconventional Western ever. Wild, wild west defied definition. It was set in the Old West with science fiction-like gadgets and a leading man right out of James Bond. The show is, is bizarre. You know, it's escapism fair. That's the best two words I can say to apply to that show and what that show uh, is. Stay right there. For many, the main appeal of the series was star Robert Conner. His tough guy image was well earned. When Robert Conrad was just six years old, his mother took him to a boxing gym in Chicago and insisted he learn to fight. He did. On a fall day in 1949, playing high school football, Young Robert was on the receiving end of a particularly brutal hit. I was out of breath, and I couldn't get up right away. And there was this screamer on the high, get up, get up, get up, get up. And the guy that was with me said, who is she? I saw that's my mother. Robert Conrad's physical skills were critical to the production of Wild Wild West. Given the show's elaborate action sequences, the only way to keep the series on budget was for Conrad to do his own stunts. For that, he was well prepared. The good thing about working with someone like Robert is you don't get hurt doing that because he's in control. All of the different um, art forms that have to do with fighting. I mean, he was quite unique in, the, in, in that era. Even... If he was kicking somebody, he was doing a proper kind of uh, a proper kind of a kick. Well, it's like a dance routine. You know, it's the same thing. You practice certain steps when you dance, and when you do a choreographed fight, you do the same thing. So working with Robert was a pleasure because as we worked out the choreography, it was, you know precision being done and no one got hurt. Oh! I expected this to us to add a little spice to the struggle. But even the most choreographed fight scene required a certain amount of improvising in the moment. You were small. You sure got You know that you try not to fall on him. <laughs> That's what they don't fall on that man, <laughs> but but enjoy it and, and and go with the go with your character. So he had all these ways of attacking you that made you, you know, go down. If he was doing it and was so choreographed that everyone would know it, then it wouldn't work. So you had to go with the flow of the thing to make it work. Robert Conrad surrounded himself with expert stunt people, but one visiting actor wasn't so experienced and made a mistake that nearly cost Conrad his life. We had choreographed it. I was to jump off the second uh, floor onto the chandelier, and this guy was supposed to stop my forward motion. I was supposed to kick him through a window. He was late coming to me, and he didn't stop my forward momentum. My hands slid, and I fell uh, 15 feet to the floor and had a high temporal uh, concussion, a six-inch lineal fracture of the skull. Rushed to the hospital, Conrad spent months in recovery. Production was shut down. The following year, shooting resumed right where it left off, with James West on the floor. Robert Conrad insisted that the footage of his near-fatal fall remain in the episode. Wild Wild West wasn't a one-man show. Robert Conrad had Ross Martin to play off of. Sheila's very pretty and very charming, but I don't trust her. And now, you get to be an old codger like me. You learn to admire and revere the fair sex, as I do. 
I wouldn't trust you either. He was so totally different than myself. I mean, he spoke five languages fluently. Uh, he was studying uh, law before he became an actor. The pairing was perfect, and audiences responded. Oh, you did it! I don't want to say anything, <clears throat> but uh, I helped. Oh, thank you. Thank you. You're certainly welcome. Yes, you've made my whole day. Wild Wild West was the surprise hit of 1965. Wild Wild West was still going strong in 1969 when CBS abruptly canceled it. The reason wasn't ratings. Rather, it was pressure from the government. Senator Pastore of Rhode Island I thought it was too violent, and he told me that the show had been canceled, not for ratings. It was in the 30s then, but because of the violence. 